Very short video here on dealing with uh, strings and characters. Uh, it's a feature that I find very handy and uh, a lot of times we want to find out how much has been set aside and how big the string is. So I've got uh, strings here and I'm going to declare two things. I'm going to declare a uh, 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 string. Uh, my name looks familiar, doesn't it? Okay. David Gatros. Okay. End quote, semicolon, and I'm also going to declare a uh, character um, name. Okay, and we'll say it is size uh, 21. We're going to go ahead and initialize it to also uh, David A. Gatros. And what we're going to do is we're going to show you the different uh, length functions that uh, are associated with this, and very handy. And uh, I'm just going to print out the numbers. Okay. Um, first of all, let's do the uh, the uh, character arrays here. Uh, C out. Okay. Uh, okay. The length of the whole array, uh, the whole uh, character array is, and then we're going to split it, this. It is size of, and we're going to put name. Now, what this is going to do is is going to look to see how much space was actually set aside for it. Okay, it should it should come up uh, 21. Okay, Let me put the uh, right uh, symbols here so it compiles correctly. Up. Okay. Size of. All right, very good. So that should tell us the. It should print out 21 characters. Okay, now. Uh, what we're going to do is uh, along that same line we're going to uh, length of thing stored in uh, the car array is and now we're going to put uh, a let me change this so it works right okay uh, str length name spell that correctly, L-E-N name. Now what that should do is it should count the number of characters up until the null terminator. In other words, the up here it should count the number of characters uh, up into but not uh, just past the S. It shouldn't count the, uh, the null character. And now now we're going to uh, print out and we're going to tell you how many uh, characters are stored in the of uh, the uh, String array is okay, and we're going to say okay, and that is done by using the uh, string library um, my name dot length in L. So uh, three different ways, and they're very handy. Sometimes you want to know how much space was set aside for a character array. Sometimes you want to know how much is stored inside that character array. Uh, with the string library, there is no reason to ask how much space is set aside because it always sets aside enough space to actually store the item itself. So you only really care about how long it is. So let's run this. Let's build it. Build solution. looks good okay let's run it all right so very good now let's look at this okay so we said the whole array is 21 that's correct it's 21 characters set aside that's the character array there are 16 characters in it now if we count this one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen characters up into s it doesn't include the null character that's the character array and we get the same thing on the string array the my name right there, both 16 characters. Very, very handy way to figure out how big something is stored inside either a character array or a string type. Uh, good video, good video. Uh, write this code, play with it, and remember uh, these functions, they come in very handy later on in the class.